This exercise is going to be the wand exercises for shoulder range of motion. Um, all you're going to do is get a stick at home. You can use a broom handle. You can use a umbrella if you have a dowel sitting around. Something that's light that is long enough that you can hold in both hands at about shoulder width apart. So. Um, here at the clinic, we just have some PVC pipe that we, that we use. I'm going to give that to him. Um, the closer your hands are together, the more the uninjured arm is going to be able to help. So if you need to, if you're, if you're apprehensive about trying this exercise for the first time or you're still in a little bit of pain, try with your hands all the way together and eventually you can work your hands apart. So the first thing you're going to do to make sure that you can that you can do this exercise without too much pain is we're just going to do a press up. So kind of like a bench press, just coming straight up and down, working the shoulder range of motion here. Once you can do that pretty easy and it's not painful at all, then I'd have you stop at the top and now we're going to work back up over your head and just go as far as you can without pain. Hold for two or three seconds, it doesn't have to be a long hold, and then come all the way back down to your belly. Sometimes the down motion can be pretty painful if you've had a rotator cuff repair or some kind of shoulder surgery. If that's the case, then you don't have to come all the way down. You can just work that pain-free range, so maybe that's to here, and then work them back as far as you can. And then come them back to here, wherever that pain-free range is. So stay away from the pain, and then if you're having pain, bringing it all the way back down to end the exercise, you can just bring it back down to your chest like this. So that's how you do wand press-ups. So this is the press-up, okay, up and down, just like that. Good, and then back up over your head, is back as far as you can without too much pain, and then coming all the way down to your belly if you can. Good, so that's how you do the uh, range of motion exercises with the wand at home.